All right, BVPN fans, here we are. The last of the final four, and then we go on to the finals later on tonight. We are going to take a look at the last match we had. Of course, this one was a battle royale. Yes, you know, once again, your dreaded Wood Elves, the number one qualifying team. But they're up against the Dark Elves today. So, is there any guarantee they're going to win this one? Not by a long shot. Dark Elves have got something to prove. And that they're real Elves. Unlike those princing, prancing little fairies that are the Wood Elves. Alright, let's see what happens here. Let's get to the stadium. And we'll see if they have any crazy excitement today. Alright, right. Thank you for the flip there, Constable Ed. There you can see it is bloody winter pink. Yes, this is going to make life interesting. Remember, GFIs, one or two, you trip, and you can only pass up to short range. So, life just got interesting, didn't it? All right, let's take a look at the fall of Nancy. Three re-rolls, they've got two of all the kiddies. <laughs> Don't trust the mahogany, do they? No, apparently not. And, of course, they do have, you know... A bit of booze just in case. However, the fans, well, they don't give a crap right now. They just want to see blood. Lots and lots of blood. Hello here, Steiner. He is here already live cheering on. As you can see, the Dark Elves, they bought an assassin for this game. Yes, they did. And they do have the one spare runner. You can see here, yeah, crazy skills he's bought. He's even got past to go with the dump off. It means he actually knows where he's throwing the bloody ball. Might be a critical game. All right, here we are. There is the kick. What have we got? Everyone gets a re-roll. Crap. Yes, I know. It's only crap. And then, yes, it's a touchback. Crap. <laughs> yep, everything that could have possibly gone wrong on that kick absolutely did. Oh, well, that should make life interesting there. As you can see there, full Nats. He's a full cop with 11. And look at the skills all over the place. And yes, they did bring in a tree. They're going in melee for the early removal here. They're going to go pick all the port. It is the dirty player. And they took him out already. Hell yeah! That was pretty bloody quick. Absolutely quick. Yeah, quick jump in there. And yes, absolutely good surgical removal. Oh, well, that solves a few problems, doesn't it? No fouling for you, Sunshine. There's the wrestle on the front line. Well, that takes away where you want victims to the trees here. Trey is still going to get the three dice in. This is going to be painful. Of course, so could this be. Here we go. Solid punch. Good lord. He's hitting everything today. He is off to a phenomenally big start. There is the grab. Guess what? <laughs> You're not going anywhere, Twinkle Toes. No, we're not singing that song. We're not singing that. You can sort off about that song. Hopefully they don't score once, otherwise I'm stuck with it. Alright, here we go, Dark Elves. Well, they're already facing one removal. It is the dirty player. And now they're going to try and get back into the business here. Like I said, it is going to make life interesting. Four rerolls for this half. Everyone's got a reroll. You've got a reroll. You've got a reroll. Everyone's got a reroll. Ah, uh, here comes the lovely calendar girls. Everything she tried, and it just isn't working. All it is is a wrestle. Well, that's all right. He tears the corner. He's going to see, can he force him to score this one early? That is a big question here. It really is the debate between everyone there. What is the strategy between these two particular teams? How are they going to deal with this lovely little mess? Take the skills away. As you can see, it is a lovely mess here. Remember, GFIs, not much happening in the Blizzard here. But the Blizzard will also slow down what kind of deep and throw away plays are coming in. Tree on the move. The forest is walking. The Ents are on the move. Yeah, immediately here. Yeah, Mahogany. Well, we'll see. Mahogany didn't do much good last game, did it, for the Wood Elves. 
Clearly there's been a bit of an investigation on the illegal uses of mahogany on the wood elves. And rightly so, because we can't have wood elves not breaking. That's just not football, is it? Alright, now on the move here, it looks like you're about to see something phenomenal. Yes, the wood elf cage it is something that is very really seen. It does happen on rare occasions. Lads on the move. Light screen. He has left a coin of a lair, but right now I don't think he's too worried about it. Again, because of the blizzard, GFI is just not happening. He could risk. Yes, indeed, he could risk. If you all one die, but what are the odds of that actually working? We've seen how this game's been working tonight. Dark Elves, turn two. Now, remember, the Dark Elves do actually have two reserves, and it's just a KO. So right now... From the view of the Dark Elves, they are doing just bloody fine. At least they think they're so. What do you mean Wood Elves should be caged? Yeah. Allow them to run free. Run where? Into the Wood Chipper. I endorse that decision. Alright, makes the dodge away from the tree. Well, a tree is upset. But speaking of upset, yeah, here come the Dark Elves here. Trying to get a good solid fisting in. Finally, they get a result there. There's a blow. And they got one. Thanks for standing still, wanker. Well, that's what they're hoping for, and they just did it. Yes, indeed, they just did. That is one. It's only a KO, but he's hoping it's the start of something better. The rest of his team here, well, he's not interested in staying here. He might as well keep the Wood Elves marked, see if he can force them to actually, you know, burn a reroll. Now, the reality is, he can make this dodge easy. Do note, though, yes, it is Strength 4, Block, and of all things, Frenzy. What have they got Frenzy for? Well, well, apparently this Wood Elf is certifiably insane. Alright. There we go. Wood Elf's on the move, trying to get down the field here. Push me, push you. And yes, that great debate does continue. Are they in a rush to score? Off the Dark Elves viewpoint here, yeah, if they can get away with a removal of turn, they don't really care. So far though, that Mahogany Under Armour is doing a great job. Alright, here we go, Surgical Removal here. Oh, doesn't get away with it this time, grades the roll. Doesn't get anywhere. Now, oh, well, it is now a giant cage. Yeah, everyone's bloody insane in this game. Now let's see, the lad doesn't even try to get up, you coward. Oh, well, someone doesn't trust his elf, Dickory. That is clearly an issue to be reported on later. Meanwhile, over here, well, he's got a solution to you. Pulling this elf, Dickory, it's called surfing. Lots and lots of surfing. Hey, guess what? Surf's up. And you're going to go for a wee bit of a ride, aren't you, laddie? All right, Cowler Girls, moving in a better position. Yeah, you can see that, right? He moves in there. He's got full confidence this is going to work. Yes, it does. Hello, the crowd would like to have a wee word with you. A long word with you. Ah! Now, that is absolutely delightful. Thank you. The crowd at least has gotten involved in the game. There goes the early apothecary. He's dead. Holy dooly. He's absolutely dead. It is celebration. The fans have ripped his heart out and have thrown it back in disgust. Oh, it's a great day to be alive. All right, Dark Elves. I guess their lone support here has done the business. Well, this one is not coming back. Yes, and that was an apothecary he blew on that. He had two choices. He either takes the injury or he takes the death. And take a look what his casualty was. 56. It is a permanent injury, so he just like, you know what, he's taking the death. You might as well. There is no bloody tomorrow for that one. And here we go. Yes. Yes, it is a cold blizzard. As cold as art. Yeah, thank you, Wolf Owl. You've enjoyed the game. You just missed the first step of the game. Surfed into the crowd. The crowd ripped its heart out and threw it back. Of course, the player needs that thing. But no, not today. Absolutely not today. Wood Elves are fighting in Winterpeg. And there's a good solid hit, and it looks it gets a nice little stun. Work, work. Yes, it is work indeed. Dark Elves are putting on one hell of a fight, but so far, 
Nothing perfect yet there, but as we said, the first removal and true death has already been achieved. Now remember, Wood Elves have come in with two apothecaries this game. Clearly one of them supplied by the Dark Elves. Just saying. Over here. Alright. He's going to keep things marked up and he's going to continue the process here. Oh no, can the fans do that one again? We'd be delighted to find out. Oh no, she got this one there. Solid kick. And he's feeling nice and fine. Grass grows, birds fly, sun shines, and brother, I hurt people. Well, certainly she does, all right. It's not even payday. Dark Elves moving back into a new position here. They're going to keep it scrummed and keep it nice and dirty here. And now the Sotten actually get a bit of a twitch here. I know, we all want to see the Assassin. The Assassin's going to be deadly here against AV7. He might be the miracle worker this game. Alright, otherwise, everyone else moving a position here. Dodge away from the tree. Yes, easily makes it. Where are you going, Twinkle Toes? Ah, he's got a plan. Yes, it's a good plan. Notice, no GFIs. Well, who wants to risk it in a blizzard? It's a wooden three fail. Tree continues to keep moving here. Ah, he's pretty successful of them so far. And as for the woods, well, they've got some issues here. That is now two solid removals here. Now they're starting to think, do you want to stall this out? This might end up becoming a high scoring game. It is possible there. Push me, push you. He agrees the re-roll. He's getting to the point here, he's really wanting something to happen. He really does. He started with four re-rolls. Everyone got a freebie. Turn five, he's already lost three re-rolls. And they've not been for failed plays. They've all been greeds. Alright, speaking of, over here, solid kick. Does get the power there, nicely done there. Gives himself an extra dodge, that's fine. Ball is well and truly protected, at least so he thinks. Dark Elves, trying to get right back in this one. He'll take the skills back away again, so you can see, yeah, that's the fight is real here. And it, it has begun there, there we go, solid kick, sorry the head. And he got that one. Surprise, motherfucker. Well, fortunately, he's only stunned. Like, are you saying, what's a stun? I know, it's a rare thing, this game. That's just the way we like it. Meanwhile, Calendar Girl, oh dear, well, that kind of works. Sidestep forces him out. Guess what? She gets two dice and still hits the bastard. Nicely done. Really nicely done. I bet she does. Okay. Well, Dark Elves, guess what? They actually have managed to kick the bastard out, and they're going to go after him. There we go, charging in. It's only the one dice, but it is just the push. Gets the sidestep in. Strip ball does work, though. He doesn't have sure hands. The ball goes flying. All right, who's got your balls? Someone's got the ball. Who's got me balls? Right there. And meanwhile, she gets another swipe at him. Sidestep again. Frenzy, absolutely, but the ball is free. Yeah, absolutely crazy. Absolutely crazy that one was. Here we go. Yup, it's got the tackle this time. Guess what, Tinkle Toes? You're not going anywhere. <laughs> oh, don't worry. The Wood Elves are going to pay this one back. They want their football back. They're not happy with how that one went down. Then again, I don't think they're ever happy with how things go down there. I understand she fights. There we go. Solid kick away. Doesn't get anywhere. He's running out of options. It's turn six. Yes, he re-rolls that one. Did not want just the block. Of course, just gets the push away. It does free one player. Meanwhile, tree. Oh, good lord. This is going to suck. Yep, she's hurt that one there. Get over here! And I can see it. Hear it? Yep, yep. She's not coming back, lads. She's not coming back at all. Over there. A easy tackle. Ball has gone bouncing. He fails the pickup though. Ah! Ball goes bouncing free one more time. Turn six. No rerolls left for the Wood Elves. Dark Elves have all four rerolls. What a game this is becoming. However, no guarantee this ball might be a slippery little bastard, isn't it? There we go, push me, push you here. All the Dark Elves are actually going to think about a score on this one. 
There we go, Sultan attack there, gets the hit. How's he feeling? Good boy! Surprise, motherfucker. Well, he is working on them clearly, but it's still a big question here. Does he risk the pass action here? Turn six. Remember what happened the last play? He tried that. All right, comes in. Yes, he has but his balls. Well done, he has his balls. How clever girl. He does a handoff there. Tonight we hunt. And here come the lads. They are off. They are running. And there he goes. He's hoping to get down the field as fast as he can. Run, bitch! Run! Meanwhile, down the field, there he goes. But finally, birds are re roll here. Because the witch would like to do something with you. Something nasty. Unfortunately, that doesn't work, but it does clear things up there. There we are. Turn seven. Woodall. So much for that offense. As it going? And now the frenzy's coming out this side. Good lord, he got that one. Tree back on the move. Tree's done his job so far. The rest of his team there, they're kind of wondering what's bloody happening here. Yes, this is stop. It's going to be now Minical. Does he risk it? He's going to have to start doing some elf dickery finally. Here he comes. Wall down to that is a long. Makes the extra dodge. Makes the extra move. Does get the mark. There we go. Is the Minical true? There we go, Wall Dancer. Absolute. Oh dear! You saw it right there, lads. You saw it right there. He, to he tries the shortcut, fails the dodges. Yes, he was looking for fours. You know, you could have leaped that and made it a three, lad. Just a, just a thought. You could have made that a three on a leap. All right, here we go. Dark Elves, mad scramble it is. There's no guarantee they can score this one, but they're going to try. Two dice, solid cook to the side there. Hey, look, someone's got a bit of a problem there. Nobody makes me bleed my own blood. Nobody. All right, now here's the crazy plan here. Just the push does not want the push. He wants this player down. There's the power to tackle, and he's got him down. He goes. Wall Dancer on the field. Attention, everyone. Wall Dancer on the field. Yes, no GF4. Yep, see, there we go. Someone listened to the cry. And does he get up? There's the foul. Is it any result? Oh, come on. Crap. It's just a war dancer. Come on. You would have done it too. Oh, well. Godspell Ed's having none of that this season, apparently. That is an ominous sign. All right, here we go. Tree finally takes root. Well, it's turn eight. He was bound to take root someday. And here we go. Crazy is crazy is. Yes, he can catch it, but it's going to be GFIs to do it. He does make the tag up there. All right, here comes Miracle Play. Makes all the crazy dodges and no! Oh, my. Let's hear it for Blizzard. Yeah, you got it. He slipped on a two. You knew that was coming. The blizzard has taken effect. And now here come the Dark Elves. They are going to try and take care of this one here. Three dice. Solid power. How are you feeling, so trying? And he's feeling just fine. But that's okay. Dark Elves still sitting on two rerolls. They can actually decide to take another block here. What could possibly go wrong? No, I'm not jinxing it. There we go. Solid kick. Block on block. Well, that's all she wrote. It's time to score this one in. Good day, sweetheart. Yeah, they definitely scored that one. Welcome to halftime. It is a surprise 1 0 for the Dark Elves. This halftime course is brought to you by Yonix Tailoring. Yes, he might not be always pounding your head in, but he makes a great suit on the side. All sizes, no one judged. Yonix Tailoring. All right, lads, let's get back on the field. This game is far, far from over. Of course, now, do remember here, yeah, guess whose turn it is? Yeah, it's now the Dark Elves offense here. The snow is continuing. Let's take a look at the Wood Elves here. One death, the wrestle is dead, and the KO is staying out, a wrestle is dodge. 
But over here, he has course two players. He's got the one ejected, of course. And yes, the darling calendar girl. Well, hopefully she's back for the finals. Yeah, hope. Yes, you've got your wish there, Steiner. The assassin is on the field. Yeah, I agree. Cosmo Legends wants to have the bloody frozen wastelands. Oh, well, here we are. They're one win away. Mind you, it's both teams. One win away. To tell you the story there, Wood Elves, number one qualifier. They have had a bit of a fight, but Mahogany Armour has done them good. But this might be the day. And there we go. Bridge Invasion, everyone. Let's go get them. Just plain ass normal every day. No question about it. No NFL, no year. Not named after a player. Not named after a coach. Not named after the referees. Pet goldfish. No quarterback. Dimeback. Nickelback. Simple, ordinary, unembellished, unmistakable, crystal clear, as frank as Frankenstein, as blunt as an atom bomb. One compound word. It's motherfucking goddamn sun. A bitch in fuck, fuck, fucking football. And as you can see, the fans made their choice. The Wood Elves take all three stuns, and you can take a look at who they took out. It is a bloody disaster. Dark Elves, remember, there is no fame enhancement here. The Dark Elves get a clean miss. This is the chance the Dark Elves wanted to go 2 0, and they're gonna grab that one. They are running and running hard, lads. This could be it. Fans have definitely taken control of this game. First, they go and take out and kill the good, good old war elf once he gets sent out in the surf. And this time now, they've gone and pitch invaded. And you can see it. The damage has been done. <sighs> Boy, this is calling for the drink, lads. All right, here we go. Dark elves. No time being wasted. Now, what's the assassin deciding on here? He's getting himself into a careful position. He's getting ready for who he needs to kill. That is his job. He knows it. And everyone else knows it. All right, Wood Elves. Let's take the skills away. You can see it. What a mess that pitch invasion did. One, two, three players down. He only had, you know, nine players. So that was a third of his team knocked out in one pitch invasion. But Wood never gives up, does it? It never does. And there we go. This is the scary moment. The tree is blitzing over the top. Who is he picking on? Oh, dear. Your skills are inferior. Yeah, absolutely inferior. The tree is tripped for the assassin. Down he goes. This turn is an utter disaster. All right, Dark Hills on the run. Oh yeah, they see a world of pain in the future there, and they are going to try. They're absolutely going to try there. Well, the Dolly Calder girl serves up the best here. So a little pot in there and get a solid hit. Meanwhile, the yep, Dark Elves decide that's it, full commitment. Let's go score this thing. As for you, Sunshine, would you like to meet a fist? It's an old friend of mine. As I like to tell Baldrick, it's the gift that just keeps on giving. Oh, here we go. The moment you're waiting for, the assassin comes in. He got him. <laughs> Yeah, he got him all right. That is one down player. The assassin has earned his pay in one fell swoop. And meanwhile, the Dark Elves on the move here. Yeah, they're going to hand the ball off there. Hey, no chance of a, f of a fair catch there. Oh, dear. Here we go. One more time. And the fouls are going in. Did he get him? He got him. Oh, dear. That's bloody awful. That is absolutely bloody awful. More police. You can hear the crowd. And there it is. That is score number two. Yeah, they celebrate that one, and they celebrate it well. Good lords, ladies and gentlemen, this has gone absolutely, completely strange here. The Dark Elves showed up the play. It shows even the Assassin. Good lord, yep. We should name her Assassin and Eagle Mintoya. 
you touched my football, prepare to die. Absolutely great. Dark Elves are fielding a full complement. You can see how brutal that actually was. War Dancer out of play. He still has the Water Apothecary. No, I'm serious. He still has the Water Apothecary. Going, why doesn't he apothecary that one there? Well, he's figuring he's got to save something. All right, free move. It's time to get moving. All right, let's go. Now, we have seen Minacles done by Wood Elf teams here. It is 2 0. We admit that. It is 2 0. Wood Elves just have to get on the board and then they just have to steal the football. This being a blizzard, it is perfectly possible. They just need, finally, Nuffle to stop giving them the run around and with oh, the cursey reach around. All right, Tree gets his first big solid hit. Doesn't get anything, though. As you can see, the Wood Elves here, it is everything they can do. They're going to try and go for the one turn. And it might actually work. Remember, that is a movement 10 War Dancer. All right, he's got the ball. He's got into a better position. Uh, right, here we go. There's the pass. Tries it again. He's got it. All right, now he goes for the quick handoff. He's got it. Ooh. Oh, you are a smart one. I understand now. Oh, God, not this song. Uh, why? We do not. Well, they're on the board. They have pulled it off. You just want to be tormented with that one. Yep, they made the touchdown there. It is now 2-1. Now you're going, why is he going to score that quick? Because he knows. He needs to score quick. Just take the turn. Done. And then he has to actually go and steal the ball to make this a fight. It is 2-1 Hootie Hoo indeed. I'm surprised he's so quiet about that wolf owl. It was absolutely the worst thing you've ever seen. Elf running that fast? How dare he? All right, Dark Elves. Now, here's your bet. Can the Assassin make it too? You never know. It's one of those days. All right, anyone can get under the ball. All right, let's go and get this ball. Yeah. Now, remember, it is snowing, so it's a little trickier there. It comes out of the rafters eventually. Yeah, he's got it. No problem. Yeah, he's the guy he wants it. All right. Dark Elves back on the offense one more time. Oh, good lord. They just took out another one there. Oh, well. Yeah, trying to settle it in Smash. The Dark Elves would like this game over with. It is scary that it is now 2 1. All right. Running in the Assassin here. Oh, not taking a stab, are you? How? Oh, well, you just want to beat him in. Oh, well, I approve. So he doesn't actually get this one, though. Oh, dear. He got him. And get off my lawn! That's just a stun, though. Oh, well. The panda does survive. One more day. Everyone else is running down the field there. What does panda actually think of this game here? Really? That bad, eh? Oh, it's that bad. Okay. All right, bit of an offense going on here. Darling Calder Girl on the move here. He might actually want to get here to score this thing. Maybe, maybe not. All right, now. Yeah, son. End zone's that way. Y you realize that didn't actually get you anywhere. Oh, well. Yep, Dark Elves are actually pulling a stall game. They're going to force the Wood Elves to come to them. Two to one, they could do it, but could it backfire? 100%. A couple, of, a couple of ones in the right spot and the whole game's over. The Wood Elves are laughing their way all the way back to Nottingham Forest. Ah, uh, yeah, you see it right here. Wood Elves are getting in a position. They're not going to let them get away with that. They're going to try do their best to take this one out. 
All right, here we go. Surgical little attack there. Does get the sorted power. Does he get him, though? Sa yep, just knocks him over. But he does move into a threatening position. It, it's the best he can do. Be an honest threat and then have the rest of the team see if they can recover this one. It might even work. This is what you call desperation. Well, here goes the assassin one more time. He got him. And his name is John C. Well, I don't know if that actually is his name, but he has done the job again. Didn't kill him, but he did stun him. And yes, it is possible to have two assassins on your team. Yep. The Well, the Dark Elves can do two assassins. It's bloody brutal. Now, remember, assassin only is on AV7. He's got an IG of 4, strength 3, movement 6. But he's got shadowing and, of course, stab, stab, stab. They usually have short lives, but they can do bloody miracles against an AV-7 team. Oh, you've got Blodge. Oh, I've got a dagger. Doesn't care. And that's what he's using it for. All right, Dark Elves on the move once more here. Everyone's dodging away here. Yeah, it's just like the original Blood Bowl. The assassins are great. You have Blodge. The assassin doesn't care. Meanwhile... There goes a solid hit, and he got him. Message for you, sir. Yeah, and you saw that. He apothecaries the KO. He needs this war dancer still in the game. He cannot afford him KO. Unfortunately, Constable Ed there, he is still trying to get his nappies nice and warm. So I don't think he's really looking. He's probably standing awfully close to that pit fire over there. Yeah, it's where we roll the dead elves at the end of the game, you know? You got to dispose of them somehow, nice and environmental-like. Oh dear. The tree is blitzing, is he? Oh, we're up three dice! Oh, this is gonna hurt. This is absolutely gonna hurt. Oh, good lord! Oh dear. Well, he's down. Yeah, well, you gotta do something to make a removal, and he certainly has that time. The tree has done it. He's removed at least another one. So, yeah, the Dark Elves have actually now finally shot a player. Finally, as he said. And the Dark Elf offense continues here. We'll get the skills off so you can see. Yeah, it's a bit of a scattered mess here. It's not over, though. By a long shot, this is not over. Good solid kick to the side there. Down goes another taking point off. And here they come advancing down the field here. Now it's now we're going to T. Now we have to call up the skills to show you what you got here. The runner now has to try and get into a protected position here. Because this wall dancer, I get into you, is going to beat him in. Alright, runners come moving in there. He does make the pass. There's the throw. And there we go. He's got it. Clench the butt cheeks. And he's running. He's going to make sure that one is definitely in there. Uh, well, they are celebrating indeed. This has become quite the game. Now, what do you want to bet he's going to go for the one turn again here? No bet in the chart today. All right. If he goes for the one turn, it does keep him well within range. And that is basically the key. He wants to be well within range and keep the game close because he's looking for a turnover. It sums it up there. Notice here, neither team has used a reroll. They started with three this half, neither's used one. Uh, so you're all wondering it's due. I think everyone here is thinking it's about due. There's going to be a turnover any minute now. Once again, movement 10, getting into position there. And for fun fact, there, he's got quite a few skills, including, yep, you know, leap, dodge, tackle, sidestep, mighty blow, packet of crisps. Yes, he is a level 6 player. Bloody amazing. Free re-roll, they could use that. I approve. Mind you, not that they've actually done anything with the re-roll so far. Not like the first half where he was bleeding re-rolls, unfortunately. Alright, here we go. Tree uses the grab, goes, well, fuck it all. I'm just going to hit something. 
and doesn't get any result. You know, he'd like to crack something. Alright, here come the Wood Elves here. They are moving into crazy position here. Are they actually doing the one-turner? They might be just going for the quick quick warning just in two turns. And then see if they can steal the football. Oh dear, he blunders that one. Nine, 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 nine. There was your double one. And his name is Panda. That, of course, lads, is a bloody disaster there. Double one. That is his second one. Mind you, he hasn't rolled it to one most of the rest of the game. That other one, well, it didn't matter at the time. This time it matters. Dark Elves. However, do you remember Blizzard? What are the odds the Dark Elves will risk the GFI going for it? Eh, it's a hell of a maybe, isn't it, lads? Score is 3-1 to one here. Push me, push him. You know, he actually made him closer. Oh, you're going to rip his face off. Maybe, maybe not. No, you're going to go take the catcher out here. All right, here we go. Nelt misses him. Saves the reroll. Look, it's turn 14. You got three. Nope. Dark Elves are feeling like they're in a bit of cruise control. All right, here we go. There's a bit of a risk. He's going to mark them with the runner of all things. Doesn't do the GFI. Just doesn't trust his... And now he stands in front of the tree. Here comes the darling. Yeah, she's got everything covered in that and a packet of crisps. Absolutely delightful. Well, look, someone's dodge actually worked. Tree does try. There we go, makes the dodge away. He's now got the gold. Oh, good lord, he's going to go for the chain push. Well done, lad. That is a smart bit of play. Does get away with the push. Wouldn't mind the knockdown as a bonus, but he'll take that. Moves into position here. Oh, God, it is all risk. He's got it. He's got it. Oh, God. <laughs> you know, it's not a double one, it's a double two. But in this case, since he was trying to cut the corner. Oh, dear. He got him. Do it. Yep, just stunned him, but it did do the job. And I think you're seeing, lads, the collapse has begun. This might be it. This might indeed. Now you're thinking, why is he doing that? Because remember, Blizzard, he can only fire it six squares. He had to get the ball close to make the pass. He couldn't make it from back here. Tell us if the Blizzard might come in handy. Meanwhile, here we go. Dark Elves, you know, they're a bit insulted by all this here. How'd you like to meet me boot? It's a good old friend of mine. Yeah, it goes along with the fists. They're matching set. Okay, runner's got the ball. He's going to do what a runner does this best. He got it. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Well, maybe, maybe not. Like I said, the blizzard's what finally did him in there. He had no choice. Otherwise, he would have thrown it from back here. All right, here we go. There's a solid hit, and he knocks him down there. I will look for you. I will find you. And I will kill you. Well, he's going to try and kill him, all right, but it's only a KO. Sorry, no more deaths so far. And you see here, yeah, Wood Elves. He just parks his plate in the end zone in case the ball somehow ends up down there. Fails the dodge. Oh, boy. Oh, what a day. What a lovely day. Well, maybe not for the Wood Elves, but it certainly is for the Dark Elves. Turn 16. Time to put this one away. You're going to the finals, lad. Yeah, they definitely enjoyed that one, but it is in 4-1. to one. Not the score you expected when this game started. Not by a long shot, but the damage has been done. That is it. Dark Elves, they're advancing to the finals against, you got it, the Chorps. 
Hey, look, free re-rolls. Everyone gets free re-rolls. I'm surrounded by idiots. Feels that way. The blizzard has not stopped. All right, he's got the ball. He fails it again. That was strangely arousing. Hey, look, it's on top of this time. All right, here we go. There's the quick pass. Hey, look. Numb Nuts has got the ball. And now here comes the fun. Yeah, I think he's going to try it. Just for sake of it, he's going to try the wind turner. At least it's a moral victory, lads. He's going to try it just to prove. There we go. He's got the push there. It's a sidestep. All right, next. All right, we got to get another player. Come on. There we go. Next push. Well, gets the push. Down he goes. Over here. Sidestep. And he's not done with you, lad. There we go. There's the run. Oh, God, we're going to be doing this song again. Oh, God. You did this to annoy me. You really did. No, that is it. That is finally your score. Yep, there you go. It is now going to be finally 4-2 is your end score. That was one hell of a game, lads. They played it. They played it all the way. But in the end of the day, well, there's nothing much you could do about it there. Just everything went wrong. Boy, did it ever go wrong. And it's a blizzard. And the life carries on. All right. So you're going to be seeing coming up in your final later tonight. It will be none other than the Dark Elves. Blitzberg Bubble Please against good old Hammer Time. And Murderopolis Mayhem. Yes, indeed. That is what we're going to be seeing later on tonight. And we're all looking forward to it. Okay. Novel, bless your dice. And I'll see you all later tonight.